Hello guys, welcome to another new video. In this video, I am going to show you how to make this easy text animation on Filmware 12. So without any delay, let's get started. So first of all, open your Filmora, then go titles and add default title into the timeline. Then select your text and edit your text from here. Then set font and size as you like. So I think this is perfect. For making this animation, we need to mask this text. But as you can see, this text have no mask option. So we need to convert this text to image. For this, take a snapshot of this image. For taking snapshot, you need to click this icon. Just simply click on this and click OK. Now here you can see a snapshot or image had been added in our project panel. Then delete text from the timeline and add your image to the timeline. Then select image and here you can see the mask option now visible. Then simply click on mask. And here you can see there's many masks that you can use. But I choose this parallel lines mask. Now as you can see our mask is now visible. Now set mask according to your animation. First I set to rotate. Then set width. And set blur strength. So now it's look like this. Then set the position here. So now we need to add keyframe. Go to the first frame of text. Then add keyframe in width, position and blur strength. Then go some frame later. And set position here. Let's check now. So as you can see our animation is now visible. Then go some frame later from second keyframe. And again set keyframe in width, position and blood strength. Then go some frame later. And set position to middle and increase width to maximum. Now let's take preview. So as you can see our animation is showing. Then select text and go basic. Now we want to add a scale animation. For this go first keyframe and set a keyframe on scale. Then go some keyframe later and increase some scale. Now let's take preview. So as you can see our animation is showing. It's so easy to do this. You can save this animation or mask for next use. For this, select text and go mask option. Then go down and here you can see option called save as custom. Just click on this and rename and save it. Now let's see how to use this. First add your snapshot. Then select snapshot and here you can see our custom mask showing here. Just simply double click on this. And here you can see our animation is added. You can also set video below this animation. For this, add a video. And add video below the animation. Now let's check preview. So as you can see our animation is now ready. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. 
please like and subscribe to our channel for more cool tutorial and give a thumbs up for this video and thanks for watching goodbye